It almost feels like the Nintendo Switch is the perfect system for Animal Crossing. We've always had to choose between the superior graphics and constant reliable internet connection of consoles and the portability of handhelds. But no longer! After years of not really new games and that steaming pile of garbage Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival, a new game for the Switch isn't a matter of if, but when. So, uh, here's a bunch of features I want to see. With the introduction of amiibos into Animal Crossing, your village is gonna have a lot of slots filled up from the start. There are all the cool ones based on existing characters, and all your favorites can be put in the game via amiibo cards. It's really cool, but it leaves less space to meet new villagers. Like that chocolate squid or something. So I think bigger towns are pretty much a given. Which would also help with the next thing I'd like. This next one is probably just me, but ever since Animal Crossing City Folk, the games have included this alternate area where a bunch of shops are. It was an okay gimmick then, but in Animal Crossing New Leaf, they moved pretty much every single facility into that marketplace area. Personally, I think it was a lot more interesting when all the shops were actually in your town and not clumped together and shoved out of the way into Main Street. The entire deal with Animal Crossing is having your own unique randomly generated village, so just having the same area for every player that you gotta kinda break immersion and load and go out of the way to get there, eh, I, j I just don't like it. At least, compared to how it used to be. Collecting stuff for the museum is one of my favorite things to do in Animal Crossing, but they haven't added a new thing to collect ever since the first game. Well, I mean, there is the diving thing, but that was more of an extension of fishing. I'd like to see something completely new, like maybe the museum could add a botanical garden where you could collect plants and trees and mushrooms and stuff. Or if they dug a little deeper, ha, they could add to the game's mining mechanic and make a bunch of gemstones you can collect, and add to the museum's new geology exhibit. I'm just spitballing here. Okay, we can all agree on this next one. I'd like to get more options to place things around. Specifically villagers' houses. I know everybody hates the fact that villagers just move everywhere and ruin everything. That's a feature that should have been there by day one. I don't know why they've been ignoring it. On a similar note, I'd also like to see a grid system for putting down public work projects. Because I swear, it is so needlessly complicated trying to get the project right where you want it. Like, Jesus, Isabel, why? The Nintendo Switch has really been pushing multiplayer, what with the two controllers in one gimmick. So, I think it's finally about time Animal Crossing added split-screen co-op. Or, or not co-op. They should finally add the ability for axes to actually kill other players. If Animal Crossing wants to keep up in this modern world, they gotta go for that hard M rating. Look up in the sky, is it a bird? Is it a, is it a plane of some sort? No, it's an eviction notice. I want to get rid of villagers without having to wait. And also, I don't want villagers to be able to leave unless I give them permission to. I'm looking at you, Phoebe. You left me. You left me while I was gone for three days. <laughs> this one's a long shot, but why not just add the entirety of Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival into the new game? They already added the best minigame into the New Leaf Amiibo update, so I don't see why they couldn't just add everything else. Not like they'd lose any money, since no one bought the original game at all. Look how cheap it is, jeez. Yeah, it sucked on its own, but if it was just a bit of side content to go with the main game, I'd say it'd be a pretty neat distraction. Plus, each individual village could be a completely unique game board, so that'd be pretty cool, I guess. Well, that's all I got. Animal Crossing has always been a near and dear series to my heart, so the mere thought of something like the Switch is just... is good. I like it. If there are any features I didn't mention that you'd like to see, like an animal mafia or giving Isabelle a Pope hat, then please leave a comment down below. I'm genuinely curious what you guys will think up. Thanks for watching!